Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. This is Clary Slim. Today I'm going to show you verb noun verb base form. So what does that mean? It is a bit confusing and uh, very few children actually can identify this unfortunately. So this is something that we really need to understand because by the time PSLE or even most of the school's test papers, they will have at least one of this question. Okay, so this is one of the grammar MCQ question. One out of ten. Okay, so this is a 10% score. So if you really want to get that full marks, you really need to understand this one. What is verb, noun, verb, base form? Okay, so father wanted to know if Jack was the one who made Sally. I think most of us will know that the answer is cry, made Sally cry, but we do not know how to explain it or why it is like that because obviously this is something that's past tense or so wanted to know is past tense. Jack was the one past tense. So made is also a past tense. So why is the answer not past tense? A lot of children will ask because the format is like this. If there is a verb that acts on a noun, the next verb that comes after must be a base form. Okay, so again, uh, if a verb acts on a noun and the first verb that comes after this process, it has to be in the base form. That's why we call it the verb noun verb base form grammar rule. Okay, so who made Sally cry? Answer D. However, this base form doesn't apply to everything. Sometimes it can be ing, the continuous form. Okay, for example, I heard Sally crying. That's fine too. Verb, noun, verb, ing. Okay, so we'll keep that in mind. Let's try another question. Question two. So can you find the verb, noun, verb in question two? I came late and missed seeing my sister, Vinette, the other runners to cross the finishing line. So the reason why children cannot find the verb, verb because it's not so direct all the time. So for example, you miss seeing something. You miss seeing the sister. So this becomes the noun. This is the verb. Seeing your sister, the verb behind must be therefore base form. So the answer should be seeing my sister outrun the other runners. Answer A. Do you see that? Okay, let's try another question. See if you can identify the verb now, verb base form. Okay, you may pause the video here to try it on your own. This should be quite easy. Rachel saw Mark steal the wallet. This is the verb now, verb base form over here. Answer B. The apprentice watched the chef. So, verb now, Verb, this has to be base form, the chef cook, A. Notice that verb number base form means no S, no ED, no ING. Even though it is one chef, there is no S. You cannot say cooks. Okay, let's try the next question. You can pause the video here to try this on your own. So, we heard verb, now, verb over here. We heard Jean. Scream. You don't even need to read what's behind and that is definitely the answer. Verb now, verb base form. To Mrs. Chan's horror, she saw verb now, verb base form, saw her daughter run across the road. Do you see the pattern now? Let's try a few more. You may pause the video here to try it on your own. Verb now, verb base form, saw the burglar break. Answer A. Olivia saw the man, verb, now, verb, base form, saw the man slip a watch into his pocket. Answer A again. Are you getting it? Do you see the pattern? Pause the video here, try this on your own. I'm sure you can get this right. Saw a man fall, verb, now, verb, base form. Answer A. Witnessed her brother take, verb, now, verb, base form. Answer O. Notice, there's no take. So what should be the answer? Remember just now I said, it can also be ING. Okay, so this is the question where the ING comes out. Witness her brother taking the money. Answer D. Okay, so verb now, verb base form. Remember that, sometimes ING. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll see you in another video. Bye-bye.